Hi guys. Today we are going to do a small experiment uh, which tells us about compressibility of solids, liquids as well as gases. Okay. We all know that in solids the structure of the molecules are closely packed. In liquids there is gap between the atoms or molecules whatever we say. And in gases we can say that the what we say the distance between the molecules is huge. So now uh, to prove this compressibility concept, I have taken three syringes. Okay, taken three syringes. Okay. So one is filled with sand. Now this structure can be considered as solid now. Now I have taken the piston. Now I am trying to compress it. The rate of compression is almost all negligible. I am not saying that compression is not there. Compression may be there. But the compression is negligible. Solids are less compressible. Almost all we can say they are not compressible. Okay. See. This. We can easily prove this. In the other, I have taken a small balloon. I have taken a small balloon in which water is filled inside the balloon. So we can say this is an example of liquid. Okay. Now I am just taking this inside this. Okay. Now see. Now we are going to see whether it is compressible or not. So I am closing this and I am trying to compress it. But I am not going to observe any change in the shape. I am not saying it is not compressible. It is compressible but extremely compressible ability is less in the case of liquids. See, this we can easily prove. Now we are going to move towards the gases. This is a small balloon. Inside we can take air is there. Inside air is there. Now see, I am taking this. Now this is the piston. I am closing it. Now see whether it can able to be compressible or not. Now you can observe its size is going to be decreased. Okay, am I right or wrong? The size is decreased. Now the size is increased. Now the size is decreased and the size is increased. See, you can even observe this increase in the size. So we can say gases are highly compressible. Gases are highly compressible. So by this experiment, we can also prove Boyle's law. What is Boyle's law? The pressure is going to be increased volume of the gas is going to be decreased. See, in that closed thing, now I have closed it. Now I am increasing the pressure. Then the volume of the gas is going to be decreased. This is what we call as Boyle's lamp. Hope you enjoyed the small experiment.